shows the different types of common minerals and uh, are uh, performing, uh, which are based on their base info, their structure info, uh, and uh, we also have different uh, structure uh, being formed. So, among these structures being formed, uh, the passive bachelor matrix being formed in network is a type of structure being formed, uh, which is simple and uh, support a uh, low uh, insertion uh, loss. So, Bachelor Matrix, uh, another advantage for Bachelor Matrix is that it is enabled as a beam scanning without any active components. So, we need, uh, in our design, we need fewer base sheets uh, compared to the other people. And one more advantage is that uh, the Bachelor Matrix can be easily implemented uh, by transmission lines on a low cost. Uh, and it also improves the coverage uh, with a high generic uh, So, uh, so master metrics are uh, used to feed the array and the most element. And uh, basically, it has n inputs of all, uh, which are connected to the main uh, transmitter as you can see that. That picture, for example, in this case, it has four input ports and four of ports. And uh, in the input side, it gives a signal and uh, n uh, input output uh, and uh, ports also ports are connected uh, to the antenna uh, element. Uh, so uh, the some hybrid couplers. Uh, base shifts and crossovers are also implemented in this design uh, to uh, transfer uh, the uh, signal to the output with a uh, sheet. So, in our proposed solution, we designed a spoke 2x4 switch beam patch array antenna, uh, which is designed for the frequency band of 5.8 gigahertz. And this array antenna is fed by the 4x4 uh, auxiliary matrix network. So, in the picture, you can see that we have four input ports and four output ports, and each output port uh, can uh, uh, feed the two elements of array uh, antenna. So uh, our design uh, consists of four 90 degree uh, hybrid uh, coupling. Uh, it also includes a two uh, phase uh, shifter uh, and two uh, crossovers. Uh, so uh, when this design is added to the form uh, one, two, three, and four, and the phase difference is generated uh, between uh, the output. Uh, so these are the master uh, matrix uh, analysis. So if we have n by n partner matrix, uh, we can easily calculate the number of hybrid components and the number of delay lines that we see. Uh, so in this design, as I mentioned, we have four 90 degree hybrid components, uh, which uh, each one has the length of long over four, uh, and also the increment of a third over a square root of uh, two. Uh, two crossovers are also uh, employed in this design to pass the signal of the components to output with a uh, real DB uh, insertion uh, loss, and also two 45 DB delay lines. Uh, are utilized to shape the Bosler uh, matrix. So the S parameter matrix of uh, the hybrid uh, coupler uh, is described here. So the problem uh, and all inputs uh, are uh, used to analyze the behavior uh, of the crossover station, uh, which uh, consists of two line uh, couplers. So basically, we designed uh, the modular uh, matrix uh, and antenna in compound multi-physics, uh, and we also simulated the modular uh, matrix as four, uh, 